中意咧？Deer, stick the bark up the trees again. Something moved. Hey, anyone home? You're going in there. Mind looking around for me frying pan? Rogue borrowed it from me, then left without returning it. What's that again? It's always sat there empty, this hut. That is, till the night afore the battle. A man arrived, walked right in like for his own. Hearing at the goings on. Because next I knew, there he was, coming my way. So, I grabbed me pan for protection, see? But he just asks all polite, Gran. Got any birch bark by chance? Lilac berries or even a few coals? Nay, says I. And you must be right daft to pester folk at night with such foolery. me pan like a magpie at a copper lend it to me gran i'll give it back come morn baffled for what's he doing frying in the dark but i've got a soft heart so i gave it to him Interesting. What happened then? Before dawn, another rode up to the hut. But come on, only the first fella left. Locked the door, hopped on his horse, and that were all I saw of him. And me pan. Twere old, black with soot, not worth much, I suppose. But I've no other. Will you help me, dearie? Bring an old widow or a pan. I could never break down that door myself. And in truth, I'm a fear to go in any road. Such a stench wafting out. Me thinks the other fellow. Well, that he's lying there.
Never taken on a pan contract. Fine, I'll go in, look around. You should wait here, just in case. This frying pan. Hmm. Scrubbed clean. Looks like the mystery man didn't need the pan so much as the soot off it to make ink write letters. What's that, dearie? Nothing, nothing. Documents. Almost entirely burnt. A few pieces still legible. But when I gab to myself, they say I'm going barmy. Cracked monocle. Interesting. Found the pan, have ye? His throat. He was garroted. And some old scars. Kind of soldier might have. Found the pan, have ye? Here, your frying pan. Mine? But mine were black with soot. And I could see myself in this one if I wanted. Them years are past. It was the soot the man needed. He scraped it off to make ink. Must have had an urgent letter to write. Urgently burned some other documents, too. And... And the other fellow? Dead. Round up a few boys and bury him outside the village. Deep, so the necrophages don't dig him up. And take my advice. Don't mention this to the Nilfgaardians. Hang about! You've earned a token of thanks. Here, son. For the road. Fry up a nice white fish for supper, or a pipe. <laughs> 